Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing great. In this short LaTeX tutorial, I want to show you the different document classes in the famous LaTeX editor Overleaf.com. As you know, each document starts with the document class and then in curly brackets, the document class. So there are four main document classes, which is the article, the report, the book, and the Beamer is for presentation slides. The article class is more compact and is used for shorter documents. The report class is for longer content with different chapters and subchapters, and then the book is really for publication purposes, which includes specific formatting for a front and a back matter for chapters and also two-sided printing. The choices between them really depends on the length, complexity, and the formal requirements of your document. As you can see here, I just created a simple example with different sections and just example text blocks you can see the document here on the right side and this would just be the layout of the article as you can see in the article we don't really have a title page so we have here the title and then it starts with the introduction then when we want to change that we just comment that out and look at the report we now recompile that and see the difference and as you can see as default the report has an own title page so you have here the title the author and the date on the first page and then you see here the different chapters you also see here the numbering of the sections is different so before we just had one two three and now 0 0.1 0 0.2 0 0.3 and then if we change to the book class we recompile that we also have a title page with the title author and date and then we have the page number on the top and not on the bottom as in the other two cases and we also have the same numbering as as the report and when we go to the next page you also see the chapter and the page number on the right side so there you have the whole content in a two page format then what you can also do you can specify here between the document class and then the curly brackets you can specify their specific options which would be this part in between so you can specify the size of the text for example 12 points then also the paper just a4 then also the number of columns you want to have and if you want to have a title page or not. There are some additional options you can choose but here I just show those four options and as you can see we have a title page we just have the article in place and we get two columns on each page on regular A4 paper. So this is already everything I wanted to share with you in this video. If this tutorial helped please leave a like and comment. For more useful later content subscribe to my channel and see you next time.